Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. So today I'm going to do a pour embellishment. Now this is a canvas I actually totally love, even though fall colors aren't really my colors, but I feel like it's kind of missing something, maybe because of the color scheme, to be honest. If it was blues, it might feel like it's complete, but it's not. So um, I'm gonna embellish it. I would do more embellishment videos, but then there's always the people that say, oh, I liked it before you embellished it. So I'm gonna risk it anyways. I'm gonna use some My Artscape paints. This one is lemon yellow, and I do have a specific thought in mind here. To me, this is kind of a, a crazy sunset. Um, so I'm gonna add a sun right here, and then basically I'm gonna have land here, and then to me, this is kind of like a sunset river. So that's my thought. We'll see what happens. You know what? I am better at finger painting suns, to be honest. And I do have some really nice paintbrushes from my Artscape as well. But to be perfectly honest, I'm not exactly sure where I put them at this time. Okay. I will probably only end up using yellow and black, but we'll see. So this isn't going to be like a lot of embellishments added, but sometimes even just the littlest things. So this is kind of the mouth of the river here to me. And maybe it goes down along like here. Okay. And then we're going to have some mountains or trees, hills that come up. I don't want to take away too much of that sky. That's my favorite part. So I'm just doing a little bit here. And you guys indicated that you did not like these sped up. You kind of wanted to hear through my thought process. So that's what I'm gonna do here. Um, this whole part, I'm just gonna fill in with black and then I'm gonna give it a little, I'm gonna make it a little less perfect so that it's like there are trees. So I kind of imagine maybe the, the land even going like here, and then there's going to be reflections, basically. But since it's a sunset, it's pretty dark, so we're not going to worry about delineating there. And I am not, like, the best with lighting or shading, so I just do my best. All right, so I'm going to just go ahead and basically give this a little, like, take out some of the perfection there. So it's more like there's trees going along. Same thing on this side. I didn't wash my brush in between, so there's still a little bit of the yellow in there. That's okay. And then I'm going to do the same as we get down here. Because like I said, this is kind of like a reflection on the water there. And I would love to do more embellishment videos. Let me know what you guys think. And also any specific embellishments. Some people definitely have given me some ideas that I wasn't like super thrilled about. I don't know that I'll ever do a mermaid, <laughs> to be honest. We'll see. Um... But I do think I'll have some, uh, maybe a dolphin coming up. Obviously, you guys probably know I love trees since I do them quite frequently. So I'm trying to get away from doing that as often. Um, I did kind of an African sunset a while back that I really, really liked. So I might do another one of those. That was really pretty. And maybe I can definitely do some, like, elephants, like maybe a safari kind of theme. Anyways, if you guys have ideas, feel free to let me know. This one is going to be rather simple. Okay. So this part, I don't want to have quite the angle I have there. Okay, 
I'll probably put a second layer of black on here. But I did also do a recent painting where basically I uh, spray painted in a circle and I actually really liked that. So I was kind of thinking of doing that on here. And the only other thing too would be maybe brightening up this space a little bit. I haven't really thought about how to do that without um, taking away too much of that background. So I think maybe I'll just make this sun a little bit more like hazy around the outside there I kind of like that and I'm gonna leave it at that okay so I'm gonna let this dry and then like I said I'm gonna do I think that spray paint idea around the sides and I'm gonna put a little more black over here as well so I'll be back Okay, so last step I want to do on this is I'm going to take a record, um, and this is obviously just like 12 by 12. I'm going to center it as much as possible. You definitely don't have to. And I'm going to just set it down. And then I've got some, uh, this is just flat black paint and primer. And don't worry, this was a scratched up record, so... I'm just going to be painting over it anyways, so this will help me prime it, and here we go. Okay, let's take a look. There we go. I love it. Let's do a close up. All right. So you can see the circle even where it is black um, because they're two different blacks. And um, I don't know, it just adds a little more interest to the painting for me. I think this is super cool. I do have to still fix up the edges. So I'll do that a bit later. Just we'll be painting them all black. But there you go. Simple embellishment, uh, turning this into a sunset river. Hope you guys like it. I will see y'all next time.